Hey, what's up, you guys? I'm here uh, to do this tutorial on this cottage. Uh, I think it's a pretty nice little house for survival mode. Um, I got one in my survival world. I don't live in it, but I have it just to brag about. Um, the inside, the outside looks okay. It's not the best thing I've built, but the inside, I do like the interior a good bit. It's got a skylight. Plenty of furnaces, its own little farm, everything you really need, all into one good looking thing. Anyways, let's get started on the tutorial. You're going to need 39 oak wood to start off with and at least a 9x9 nine nine space to build it. So you're going to start off with a 1, 2, 3, 4. Two, three, four. You're gonna do that. That's gonna be a little garden area. Um, and build these four high. From there, you're gonna wanna put one right here, one over from the support. And you're gonna do another one. So, support, skip a block. Put one down, skip up. Well, that's, let's do this one sideways. Yeah, alright. Then, another support. Then you're gonna skip three. Do another support. Skip three more. Do another one. One, two, three. Do another one. So, really. You're gonna end up with a shape like this. This is really all you need. Wait, 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 almost forgot. Another one there. Okay, that's really what you should come up with. The support's four high. Down here in this front left hand corner. Gonna have four by four without the rest put there. You can go ahead and drill that hole out if you want to. That's where the water is gonna be. Next you're gonna need oak wood. How many oak wood? 93, which is one stack plus 29. Oh, Don't put it there. It's really all along this bottom uh, level row right here. And uh, right there, there. That's going to be spaces for your furnaces right there and stuff. Uh, then you want to come up here. And do like this. So you're gonna do the bottom layer, then you're gonna skip one, then you're gonna come up here to the third level, and you're gonna go all the way around again. Oh, not right there. All the way around. Can't get it right. Oh. There we go. One more. You have the bottom row, all oak wood. Skip one, and then the third and fourth row is gonna be oak wood. You have something like this. And then next we're gonna do cobblestone. You're gonna need 33 cobblestone for this build. Actually, destroy those. We're gonna make those cobblestone too. All right. You're going to want to drill out all this. So I'll go ahead and do all this on camera because it's not going to take that long. You're going to fill all this in with cobblestone. I think it's 39. I may have miscounted. Um, but it's about 39. Might be a little higher, a little lower. Alright, now you got that. Next, you're going to want to do uh, your windows. You can use uh, glass panes or glass blocks. I like glass blocks. Just, I don't know why. I think they look better. You're going to need uh, 31 of those. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 
And then for the skylight, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Perfect. Alright. Next, you're gonna need stairs, oak wood stairs, any kind of stairs. Um, you're gonna need 104 of those, which is about one stack and 41. How did I do this? Actually, uh, how did I? Okay, okay, I got it now. You're gonna wanna line this whole top row which would pretty much be the fifth layer all stairs all the way around and then you know, come up one more do it again and uh figure this out Once you get all the way around, this is the sixth layer now. This right here is going to be your skylight. Yeah, alright. This will be your skylight. You can just go ahead and fill that in with windows. If you're in survival, it might be a little difficult, but it's no biggie. You can pause the video whenever you want. Next, we're going to need slabs. Uh, we're going to need... 15 slabs. I'm not going to do that right there. All that, all them slabs, because I don't really think that looks good now that I go back and think about it. I think just doing slabs like this around the whole entire fourth uh, layer would look good. Actually, where the supports are, we could go down one, make it like an overhang type looking roof I guess I don't know I just think that looks the best I don't like putting the edges on there because I, I don't think that looks good if I do that it looks a little better on the support so you go down one like, oh, no, like, that, like this That, should, that looks about, say, 30. Looks like it might be about 30. Next, you're going to need some fence. I forgot I had everything in here. Anyways. Next, you're going to need some fence. Oak probably would be best. You're just going to fence this area off right here. Oh, right over there. Fence this off right here. You're going to need some doors. Whatever doors you want. I like I like oak wood. You're gonna place them from the inside, like this. I think it has more of a adds more depth to your build. Also, if you want to do something like like that, oh, that that'll work. Maybe no. You gonna do something like that? It'll work. Don't matter. Um, is it still doing there? All right, I'm gonna grab the stuff that you need to do the garden with. You're gonna need water, a hoe, any type, don't matter. Um, you're gonna need some wheat seeds. Any anything you want to plant would uh, work. Dang it. Oh, wrong one. And I did it again. Okay. Let's go ahead and till all this up. My sensitivity, I'm trying to get better with it being high. The sensitivity up higher. So that I can do faster. And uh, that's the garden. Now, we, what do we need? Uh, we need one bed. We're gonna need, let's see, chest, crafting table, and inner chest, furnaces, brewing stands, enchantment tables, anvils, 
and trap doors. Okay. Now, furnaces you can put anywhere. I like them right here. You can go all the way to the roof. It doesn't matter. Um. Next, we're gonna need crafting table there. You can put your bed anywhere. You can put it there. You can put it right here. You could do it. I don't know, right there. You know, maybe a double bed, a two-person house. I don't know. This build, I'm gonna put it right there. Uh, a double chest right there is where we're gonna put the infinite water source. Let's go ahead and dig that out right there. Next, uh, since you can't put trap doors on windows, you should put them right there. And then maybe do your chest area right there. Put those right there, fold them down. Where you can put torches, I don't know. Put your ender chest. I just realized something. The inner chest will glow a little bit. Y'all see that? It'll glow. It's pretty cool. Anyways. Um. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah. Brewing stand. That. That. I just, uh, found out. I didn't find out. I already knew this, but I didn't know exactly how many bookshelves it took to make the enchantment table do level 30 enchantments but it turns out you can use a uh, room with 15 bookshelves around the enchantment table and it'll do level 30 enchantments so if you want to build instead of this garden here or you can do like a door right here and a little building outside for the enchantment table you can do that um what could go here like another brewing stand yeah, that, that looks good. Now, you're gonna need some lighting. Anywhere, really. Right there. Right there. Get some outside lighting. One here. You obviously don't need to use all these torches. I'm just doing this for aesthetics. Difficult word. Not really, I just can't talk. Anyways, that is pretty much your entire house done in 12 minutes. Not counting the intro. So, uh, yeah, leave a like, a dislike, telling me why, subscribe, because there's going to be plenty more. I have all those houses to do. And I'm working on some mansions, a cool little survival bunker. Uh, yeah. That's, uh, that's it. I'm trying to make sure I didn't forget anything. Hmm. Still feel like I forgot something. Just make sure it looks the same. I could have sworn I forgot something. Oh, yeah. I'm sure you guys know how to make an infinite water source, right? It's just one block of water. You, uh, you can uh, do these three walls, that, that, and that. You can put glowstone if you wanted to. I'm not going to right now because this is a starter home. You know, starting off, you're not really gonna have, well, you're not really gonna have any of this stuff. But you know, if you're in creative mode, you can get whatever you want. But really what that does is if you fill a glass bottle with it, it doesn't go down. However, a cauldron, you can only use three, and it'll go down. And, uh, yep, that's it. Leave a like, dislike, comment, subscribe, do whatever you gotta do. And, uh, I'll see you guys later on the next one. Pieces.